Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all Sun, Moon and Rising Pisces. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please like, share these videos. Thumbs up. Um, the Pisces. This is the week of the lovers. So, so this is a wonderful week for you, Pisces. It's a water week. A lot of intuition and a lot of inner wisdom is going to come out for you guys. A lot of intuition in a way with some clarity. Um you're going to start seeing clearly things clearly um, the energy of the Sun is going to come out on um, your you're not going to be boredom anymore the love is going to come out there's going to be conflict with an and um, with an earth sign person it could be a Capricorn or a Virgo or a Taurus it could be a Taurus okay be aware of this a Taurus person there could be a conflicts um, but the money um, you have the energy of money here which is so positive so it's as if more money is going to page of money is here and it's going to bring you new um, information new situations in your life that is going to make you money okay um, the eye princess is also here and it is saying listen I do not have the menopause it's just so hard <laughs> okay all right so um, clarity is going to be extremely good okay clarity is going to you're just going to start seeing things scary you're just going to realize that someone has been listening to your conversations that stuff like that that sort of a thing that people has been eavesdropping and want to know what you do and that sort of a thing okay um, the two of Pentacles is here and your intuition your guides because you're you work with a spirit world you work with the energy of the moon and the psychics of the eye princess and she is here guiding you as how your um, financial situation is going to how you, where you should look how can you she's going to give you ideas of how to develop your and heal your financial situation in the middle and the focus for your week you have the energy of the moon which has not come out for anyone else except you guys the energy of the moon so this is fantastic because you guys work with the spirit world your rule door Neptune and you work with a spirit world and this is what is happening for you guys which is just so wonderful and so powerful because the energy of the moon is of the psychic and of Neptune and you're re receiving inner wisdom and guidance so I would prefer inner wisdom and guidance over money anytime I don't know about you guys but you know when you have inner wisdom and guidance and knowledge about stuff uh, you can be um, very then you can make money with that knowledge and inner wisdom that you have so um, the, the focus of this week for you guys is going to be connecting with the unseen world the, the energy of Neptune and it's going to deliver you in a wisdom and guide you it is going to light your part towards uh, um, the future which is so wonderful and so positive and so good okay um, you have two messages on Sunday you have um, the red of cups and you have conflicts with an earth sign person okay and that's on Sunday so maybe it's your partner and the kid <laughs> and you guys are having conflicts okay something is happening here so um, I'm trying to figure out because you have absolutely no numbers that coincide with each other which is very strange in the sense of um, the whole time because the moon is 18 and one is nine there's absolutely no coincide behind from the eight infinity <laughs> oh no this is seven this is extremely okay so i guess i have to because see you know people do not understand I channel and a sense of channeling my guides and angels bring forth these messages most of the time and sometimes they have specific message for specific zodiac sign and I you know by working at this for such a long time 
I realized that from January the energies are changing because this year you work with the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune or new beginnings so sometimes I'll have this for some sign in a week and that for some sign in a week so I just go with the flow but as you see people are coinciding with this reading these readings because they're realizing that it's 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 I don't do this for the sake of doing them I do this because I want to help people so let's look at the reading the eight of swords in the reverse form thank god i love this in the reverse form because when this is upright it's as if you have no way out you see no way out you are confused about the situation and actually you are not understanding anything that is going on so with this energy vibration that is happening you will see wonderful positive things situation coming in your life because you're actually it's as if whatever that was blocking you um the someone as you um it's, it's as if the universe and the, the the um the guides from neptune came in and cut 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 it away so here you are seeing perfectly clear what is going on so again i want to say to each and every person you need to understand where you are you need to understand the values of things that is happening in your life you need to be vocal point of who you are because this clarity that is coming in is going to be extremely wonderful for the people who have um um you know kids who are being doing the ages of 18 18 and 35 be aware of this because you're seeing clarity about them whatsoever it's happening or whatsoever was happening you're seeing clarity about them okay so this is very good and this is very positive because you're seeing clarity about them so be aware of that as we go on we have on Tuesday the two of Pentacles which is a wonderful energies the eye princess is here guiding you as to how you can balance out your financial situation and this is just for a heavy one. it's good the eye princess when she comes in she's affecting everyone in the sense because she is bringing in um, information and she's connecting with you via your intuition to tell you how you can heal your financial situation and Wednesday we have as you as I've said before the moon and the moon is connecting with the energy vibration of the inner wisdom the intuition call upon Archangel Aniel the moon goddesses and call upon the rest of the moon goddesses to touch open and align you with the information that is coming in because they're they're bringing in wisdom for you um, the energies of Neptune the the, the um, beams of Neptune is coming in in this week and it's covering you over every day of this week they're working with you from behind the scenes so you Pisces especially the ones who were born in the night this is your week um, it is the week where your psychic is going to be extremely extremely strong you are uh, well I have two more readings to do but this energy of the night moon coming up for you Pisces most Pisces most psychic Pisces so you know be aware because if you were born after six o'clock you are a govern under the moon so be aware of this and open up to the download It's a download that is coming in a download of the uh, um, information um, awakening your wisdom for some people it's awakening your wisdom it's a download of information that is coming in for some people so this is going to be a wonderful week it is governing in your week and it's going to bring you positive situation in your life so be aware of that as we move forward we have the six of Pentacles on Thursday so if you are a business person um, a lot of um you know maybe you, you have been waiting for things to be paid out and it's going to happen so the six of pentacles is going to be um the vocal point the six of pentacles a door is going to open to you manifest all the wonderful things that you have in your life okay oh, welcome back okay so we are at friday 
so on Friday we have the Four of Cups, and the Four of Cups is always people see it as boredom, but I see it as you're trying to figure out something. You're having a plan, you're trying to figure out something, and um, it's going to be okay because you're going to be successful. You're going to come out successful over this. So whatever the Four of Cups is always the time when you're trying to balance your emotional because four is the angels uh, is a number of the angels and. The energy of four is always the angels trying to con connect with you to show you things that you're not seeing clearly. But that is going to clear up and you're going to come out on top, whatever it is. As we move forward and we look at Saturday, you have the Page of Pentacles coming on Saturday, and the Page of Pentacles is going to bring you wonderful new opportunities. Okay, so the Page of Pentacles is going to bring you Pisces wonderful new opportunities. So it's going to be really, really a positive time for you guys. Uh, wonderful opportunities are coming in, new emotional experiences are going to come in. What is so realistic about Sunday you have to deal with the energy of the Empress the energy of the Empress is a wonderful energy because it is the earth sign woman this is a woman of uh, inner wisdom guidance she's a nurturing person she's very warm and loving and the energy of the um, the Knight of Cups is here uh, supporting her and with um, conflicts. So there will be a, a little bit of conflicts with the Knight of Cups and uh, the Empress with you on Sunday, but it's not anything to um, dwell on. It's just going to pass over. Uh, maybe there's a difference uh, um, of how um, each of you look at certain aspects, but this is going to pass over. So you have no worries. So, you know, the Knight of Cup energy is also the energy vibration of a younger person a younger person than you but this princess this empress is an older miss maybe she's older but maybe she's uh, she's older than you and she and the knight of cups there's going to be a sort of a conflict so be aware of that but this conflict is going to go over so you did not have any um, number energies. Um, what is happening is that Monday and Tuesday, this whole week is going to be a spiritual week for you guys. It's going to be a week that the spirit world is going to connect with you. Your energy of the eye princess comes in always. The grandmothers who are following you, um, it, it always comes up for you guys. So this is a positive energy for you guys. And I'm looking for the other um, energy card of the con connection of the spirit world to see what the Pisces have in this week and you have the energy of flame of wisdom so it's all about the wisdom in this week so you have the flame of wisdom and it says I open to Hall of Life wisdom and share with it um, and I open uh, to all of life wisdom and share it with gratitude I open to um, all of life wisdom and share it with gratitude it's a beautiful wonderful energy which is going to be positive um, extremely positive for you Pisces in this week it's going to be a profound wonderful week of um, I intuition uh, connection with a spirit world you have um, the Knight of swords and the Knight of cups and on Monday is the Knight of swords and you're moving away you are seeing clarity that really Really, there is someone either listening to your phone or either listen to your information or want information from you so spirit is going to be in helping you guys this week and I want to say please like share these videos thumbs up leave a message and I'm saying namaste until next week